Guys, subscribe to my channel hashtags with Vichel and click on the bell icon to get notified regarding the latest videos. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video it's about mm -mm, not the origami stuff but this is a first tech video where I'll be talking about the smart devices at my house. So uh, overall I have four smart devices, the AC, the Chromecast, Google Chromecast, the smart light and of course the controller which is the Google Home Mini and I'll be giving you a brief tutorial on how they work, how the integration is, how it seamlessly works over my voice. So let's start with the Google Home. So guys, as you can see, here is my setup, the Google Home Mini and the Smart Light. This is a Halonex Smart Light inside this lamp. Uh, do check out my other tutorial on how to make this lamp. So, and this is my Avengers setup. I have two. So, okay, Google, what's up? Hey, there is a lot going on in the world today. I hope you're taking care of yourself. Cool. Okay, Google, now turn on the light. As you can see, that works seamlessly integration over my voice. Okay, Google, change brightness to 50%. Okay, Google, turn off the light. So this was all about the Halonex Smart Light. Now let's go to the Chromecast, which is plugged in over my Sony TV. So guys, here is my Google Chromecast connected to my TV and I've named this TV as Bedroom TV. So, okay Google, play Stranger Things on Netflix on Bedroom TV. Takes a bit while, but yes, it plays. As you can see, due to the seamless integration it over my voice, it changed and it started playing on Bedroom TV. So this is how the Chromecast and Google Home Mini integration works. Now let's switch on the AC. So guys, this is my smart AC, the Panasonic 110 smart AC. And I recently purchased this due to this hot summer. And this works seamlessly with Google and Amazon Alexa. So let's begin. Okay, Google, turn on the AC. Sonic AC on. As you can see, it turned on the AC of my voice commands. Now, as you can see, the temperature is at 24 and it's connected to Wi Fi. Definitely needs to be connected to Wi Fi. So, let's change the temperature. Okay, Google, change temperature to 18 degrees. So let's go here. Okay, setting the Panasonic AC to 18 degrees. As you can see, it seamlessly changed the temperature. It's very convenient. Now let's turn off the AC. So, okay, Google, turn off the AC. Got it. Turning the Panasonic AC off. As you can see, it turned off the AC. So guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. And this is my first tech video and I'll be getting out more and more smart devices and I'll be making more and more devices on different techs out there so stay tuned to my channel and i'll be back next week new content new videos stay tuned stay cooler okay google turn on the ac sure turning the panasonic ac on take care guys